Hey everyone, in this video we're diving into Google AI Suite and all the bike cool things it can do for image creation and editing. With just a simple prompt, you can generate amazing AI images, edit them effortlessly, and bring your creative ideas to life in seconds. Um, I'll walk you through the different tools, show you how they work, and give you practical ways to use them. Whether you're creating content, designing, or just having fun experimenting with AI. By the end of this tutorial, you'll know exactly how to get the most out of Google's AI tools. Let's get started. So this is Google's AI Studio. You can click the link in the description to access it to see how it works and what we can create with it. First things first, let's make sure we're in the create prompt section. This is essential to get started. Um, next, we need to select the model we'll be using, Gemini 2.0 flash image generation. You'll notice it's marked as hot because it's one of the best performing models right now. Then make sure images and text is selected. For now, we'll leave the advanced features as they are, but there are plenty of customization options to explore later. Google AI Studio gives us three cool ways to use the app. Let's check out the first one. Image editing. Here, the AI creates an image of croissants and suggests a prompt. Add some chocolate drizzle to the croissants, and just like that, it instantly adds the chocolate on top. It's a super easy way to tweak images and add extra details with just one prompt. It's pretty awesome, right? Um, another example is a visual story about a little goat. AI Studio generated nine scenes, each with a story to match the images. This makes it super easy to create animated videos or storytelling content without manually designing each image. Look at how awesome these images turned out. The quality is um, top notch with a cool animation style vibe that really brings them to life. Each scene has its own unique story, making the whole set even more fun and engaging. The third example is the one with the birthday card. One of the coolest things about this model is how well it recognizes and generates text, something many other AI models still struggle with. In this example, the AI takes a birthday card design and perfectly places the text exactly as we wrote it in the prompt. This is a game changer for creating things like flyers, ads, and marketing materials since it saves a ton of time on design. No more dealing with weirdly distorted or unreadable text, just clean, accurate results in seconds. Now let's try something else, a Castaways short story. With a little help from my friend ChatGPT, I put together a prompt asking Google AI Studio to generate 10 cinematic, photorealistic, high-quality images for a fictional film about a man lost at sea, exhausted, sunburned, and desperately scanning the horizon for rescue. Um, fictional survival film depicting a lone castaway stranded in the middle of the vast ocean. It describes a man lost at sea, exhausted, sunburned, and desperate as he scans the horizon for rescue. When we generate the images, we get a full visual sequence. A man on a raft, completely isolated. A close-up shot capturing his emotions. Him catching and eating a fish for survival. A wide shot showing his struggle. And finally, a glimpse of hope as he spots a ship on the horizon. Uh, even though Gemini's image quality isn't the absolute best, the storytelling it creates is really impressive. Now, I've created another prompt asking AI Studio to continue the story. The idea is to generate more cinematic, photorealistic images that add depth and atmosphere, like the shifting ocean waves, the changing sky from day to night, and the castaway's emotions as he waves desperately at the passing ship. Let's run it and see what it comes up with. Wow, that's looking really good. It's amazing how AI Studio can generate these detailed images, making it easy to create visual storytelling and even animation sequences. All right, so I created a prompt using ChatGPT, and now I'm gonna paste it here and hit run. 
Okay. Looks like it worked. It generated an image of a shipwreck with the boat in the background. Not bad. Now, I'm going to try something else. I'll copy another prompt from ChatGPT that describes a large ship approaching. Let's hit generate and see what we get. And there it is. Hey, we've got our ship in the distance, moving toward us on the horizon. Pretty cool, right? I've converted all the images into a video with the help of Paulo AI. Then I put all the clips together and created a cinematic style trailer to show how easily we can create stories with the magic of AI. If you want to check out how it works, you can watch my previous video uh, about this app. You can also find the link in the description for Polo AI tutorials as well as the app. Let's see how it turned out. And that was the clip. Pretty cool. Now let's take it a step further. I'm adding images of two characters, a man and a woman. I'm typing a prompt, asking the AI to create an image of the two characters sitting at a cafe in Italy, drinking their coffee and chatting. Let's see how the AI generates them. And there they are. The scene looks great with both characters in place, making it feel even more natural and immersive. Now let's ask the AI to add a Vespa to the image and check this out. Um, let's type our prompt here and hit run. In the background you can see a Vespa. This just goes to show how easily we can add, remove, or modify objects in an image using just a prompt. Not only that, but we can also change character expressions. Let's test it out by making the guy smile. I'm typing a prompt and hit run. And there you have it, our character is now smiling. So as you can see, with just a few simple prompts, we can tweak and refine our images in seconds. Now let's move on to exploring more features in Google AI Studio. Um, for this example, I want to simulate that I own a digital marketing agency and need to create an ad. I've already crafted a prompt that says, I need a high converting display ad for a marketing agency. It should be modern, professional, and visually appealing with a bold headline that highlights our expertise in marketing and design. So I'll paste this in and hit generate. Perfect. It just gave us a breakdown of everything. Typography, visual elements, different ad concepts, and even size variations. Um, it's actually pretty similar to ChatGPT, but what makes it different is that I can now tell the AI to generate an actual ad image based on this information. Let's try it out. And there it is. We have a fully designed marketing ad with text, branding, and a clear call to action. Not bad at all. This could be a real time saver for ad creation. Now let's switch things up and try another example. This time I'll simulate that I own a roofing company and need branding and ad materials. I've already created a prompt for it. So let's paste it in and run it. It's generating everything, logo, color palette, typography, key messaging, and size variations. Super useful if you're starting a new business and need branding assets fast. All right, let's push it further and tell it to generate a logo for the company. Let's see if it can come up with a logo for us. And there it is. It generated a roofing company logo, expert roofing services. 
Looks like the AI just added a new word to the dictionary. While it's not perfect, it's a solid starting point that we can tweak in an editing program later. So overall, Google AI Studio makes it incredibly easy to generate branding materials, marketing ads, and even tweak image elements, all with just a few prompts. Pretty impressive, right? All right, let's keep exploring and testing out more features. In this next section, we're going to check out some more cool functions available in Google AI Studio. This tool has some incredible features, and today we'll explore a few of them. To start, let's upload our own images. Here, I have an iconic photo from the United States, the famous black and white image of workers sitting on top of the Rockefeller Center during its construction. Um, now, I'll type in a prompt. Um, color this image. Hit run, and let's see what happens. Uh, and here it is. Uh, the AI has added color to the image in just a few seconds. It's really impressive. This saves a ton of time in editing. The colors look great, although the tones are slightly pinkish, but overall the result is fantastic. Let's test another image. I'm going to upload a picture of the legendary comedians Laurel and Hardy. Since this is also a black and white photo, let's use the same prompt. Color this image and hit run. And done. Now we can finally see the image in color. Google AI Studio has done another amazing job. This app is currently free and the quality of these edits is quite impressive. Let's try something different. I'll upload a picture of a delicious donut with sprinkles, but instead of a regular donut, I want to turn it into a chocolate donut, so I'll type in the prompt. Convert it into a chocolate donut, hit run, and let's see what happens. <sighs> wow. The AI has successfully transformed the donut into a chocolate version. This is incredible. Before, we had to rely on Photoshop for these kinds of edits, but now AI does it instantly. But wait. It's missing the sprinkles, so let's add another prompt. Add sprinkles to the chocolate donut, hit run, and perfect. Now we've got a chocolate donut with sprinkles, and it looks amazing. The AI did a fantastic job. Let's take it a step further. I'm going to upload an image of two women having coffee. The goal, swap one of them with Elon Musk, and let's see if the AI can generate images using public figures' names. I already prepared a prompt using ChatGPT that instructs the AI to replace one of the women with Elon Musk. Let's run it and see what happens. And there it is. The AI successfully swapped one of the characters for Elon Musk. Uh, it did a pretty good job, although the hand looks a little off. Like still, this is something that used to require Photoshop and now AI can do it in seconds. Um, now, let's try replacing Elon Musk with Will Smith. I'll modify the prompt. Hit run. Let's see. Wow, it worked. Uh, Will Smith is now sitting in the image. Um, it's not 100% hyper-realistic, but it's still an impressive result. AI can now recognize celebrity names and swap faces in an instant. Um, now well, let's explore expression changes. I'm uploading an image of a model with a neutral expression. Right now, she looks serious, so let's see if we can make her smile. Um, I've written a prompt in ChatGPT that says, change her facial expression to a big smile. Let's run it. And, uh, it worked. The AI completely changed her expression. Now she has a huge smile. With just one prompt, we can modify facial expressions instantly. And that's it for today. Wow. We just explored some mind-blowing AI features in Google AI Studio. Uh, from colorizing old photos to transforming objects, swapping faces, and even changing expressions, this tool is incredibly powerful. And best of all, it's completely free. Um, AI is making image editing easier, faster, and more accessible than ever before. You know, what used to take hours in Photoshop now happens in just seconds with a simple prompt. So what do you think? Are you as impressed as I am? Honestly, 
let me know in the comments which feature was your favorite, and if you have any crazy ideas for AI edits, drop them below. I'd love to test them out in a future video, and if you enjoyed this tutorial, don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the notification bell so you don't miss out on the latest AI tools and tech updates. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.